Hello everybody, so today we are going to make a mixed media piece of artwork. What I want you to do is, on some paper, you can use plain paper, you can use colourful paper, you can use newspaper. I want you to um, get some watercolour paint or block paint and you are going to use the brown with lots of water and you are going to place it around this part of the page. Lots and lots of water. Once you've piled the water onto the page, you are then going to get your straw and blow away from you. Okay, so I'm gonna do some more just to make the, the brown stand out a bit more. Once I've done that, I'm going to pick some colors to decorate my plants. So I want to use green, for some leaves. I'm just gonna paint these randomly on the brown branches. I'm just using lots of little dots. Okay, once I've done that, I'm going to pick a bright color for some flowers. So I'm going to have some red flowers that I'm just going to randomly paint around the branches as well, the green leaves. Okay, and then I'm going to finish off by putting an orange dot in the center of all of the flowers as the fine if the paint bleeds into each other or you can wait for it to dry before you do this bit. Okay after I've painted my plants with all the flowers I'm going to get an old food box and I'm going to draw a pot for my plants on the inside of the box okay so not the outside the inside. And after I've drawn that, I'm going to get some scissors and carefully cut it out. I'm now going to see if it fits, and if it doesn't fit, if it's too big, I'm going to then make it smaller. Okay, that fits there perfectly. So lastly, I'm going to get some colours to decorate my pot. I'm going to use some blues. And I'm just going to create lots of different patterns on the pot to decorate it, okay? So now we've used the paint, cardboard, and now we're using permanent marker pen. So that's three different media. Okay, and once I've got my pot created, I'm going to use some craft glue or Pritt stick or PVA glue to secure this onto the paper. And make it look like our plant is growing from its pot. If you're really struggling for materials, guys, what I'd like you to do is just use um, different colour marker pens 
to create the um, effect of the paint. You can even use colored pencils as well. So once you've got your work completed, I want you to think about what you think went well about the work and if you were to do it again, what would you do differently or what would you change about the work that you've made today? I also want you to think about what other media you think you could use in this artwork um, to make it even better. Don't forget to send me your work through Dojo or through email and I will be posting some of my favourite artworks onto the school story.